John, and I am the creator and owner of Vulture Productions, as well as the creator of Robin Hood Gaming, and uh, this is my YouTube channel here, and uh, this is going to be a quick tutorial teaching you how to make your computer run faster for gaming or for pretty much any other needs you have. So um, basically, before we get started, um, I'm going to give you a few methods to make your computer run faster, but before we get started, um, I just want to say take a minute to... Uh, if you enjoy this video to subscribe to my YouTube channel right here and uh, you know if you like gaming and all that good stuff why don't you head on over to Robin Hood Gaming I'll have a link in that for the description I'm not gonna bother bringing it up right now because yeah I'm lazy moving on um, and I also have a Facebook page up here if you are uh, interested in that sort of thing um, the Facebook page is mainly to keep uh, people who enjoy watching my videos updated uh, I mostly do things like uh, parkour. As you can see, we've got like wallpapers. Um, these are actually up for download. Uh, there will be more coming soon. And uh, you will get exclusive news to videos I'm working on and videos that my uh, friends and uh, people of uh, sister companies and production companies and whatever are working on. For example, this is one. Um, this will be coming out soon, so I encourage you to go check that out on Black and White Entertainment's channel. I'll have a link for that as well. And there's Robin Hood Gaming. Okay. So moving on, here we are. I am going to, I'm running Windows 7 as you can see, but this should work on XP and you know Vista as well. Um, yeah, I know, the background. Anyway, um, I'm going to show you how to uh, maximize your computer's processor power and uh, basically make anything run faster, whether you're into gaming, as you can see, or just anything else, recording for example, or things that take a lot of processor. Video rendering for example also takes a lot of processor. So, Without further ado, I'm just going to show you a quick couple methods. One method um, is to use a removable USB stick like this. Um, this is a uh, USB stick I got. It's a scan disk, and uh, it's a 16 gig. Although you can only use 14 gig, I'm not quite sure why that is. But um, so basically, Windows 7 comes with a built-in function where you can use the memory on a USB stick to, um, you know, boost your uh, your processor power. It, it basically boosts your RAM and your processor power, makes your computer run faster for running applications, like I said, games, video rendering, whatever you want to use your computer for. Um, so I'm going to show you how to do that. You go right-click your stick in my computer, properties, use the properties here, and you want to go ready boost, and then it's currently set as do not use this device for a ready boost, meaning that it'll make your computer run faster. So what you want to do is either dedicate this device to ready boost, meaning it will use it all the time, or just use this device. And this is what I usually use in a pinch. And it will configure, and then bang. See that? It's using the memory on the stick to make the computer run faster. Okay, so that's one quick way to boost your computer. And I have one more method for you. This one is um, pretty simple. <laughs> Excuse me. So basically all you have to do is right click my computer, go properties, and then if you're running Windows 7 you'll have to go advanced system settings, but if not, if you're on Windows XP, it'll bring you right to this window here. Um, it'll probably start here, but you just go into advanced, and then you go performance, settings, and basically what you want to do is it'll be it'll be by default set uh, let Windows choose what's best for my computer. There's also for best appearance just to make your desktop look pretty. And there's also adjust for best for performance, which is what we're going to choose for now. But there is a custom, so you can go through all this list of stuff and you can pick and choose what you want. But we're just going to go adjust performance, which basically takes all the pretty stuff off. Now, note before I click apply, this is going to make my desktop look like an old 98 computer. Okay? But it will give you noticeably another about 5 frame, um, frames per second when you're running games or make your processor run faster. So, this is what your computer will look like um, if you're doing that, if you're going to use that one, that method. Um, but it will make your computer run faster, as well as the stick trick <laughs> that I showed you, um, basically. So those are you can run both methods at the same time, and it should give you uh, about an extra 8 frames per second if you're running games, that kind of thing, depending on what game you're playing. And uh, it's a pretty useful trick. I use it in a pinch when I need more processor power. Uh, works on desktop and laptops, obviously. And So anyway, I hope you found this tutorial useful. Like I said, if you enjoyed this video, if you found it helpful in any way, 
please give this video a like, and uh, if you're really feeling generous, uh, you can subscribe to Vulture Productions, you know, Black and White Entertainment, or Robin Hood Gaming if you like game videos. Alright guys, catch you later. This is John.